So today's video, I am here to do a five minutes makeup video. Like I'm gonna be done in five minutes, you know, as a magician that I am. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Oluchi. I am a Nigerian based in Istanbul, Turkey. If this is your first time seeing my face, hello. Hi, you are welcome to the channel. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you for coming back to my channel. Today's tutorial, I am here to achieve this simple face beat that I did in five minutes. No, I didn't do it in five minutes, but I was able to achieve this makeup in 15 minutes. So I'm not here to show you that you can do your makeup as fast as 10 minutes, but I'm giving you the shortest possible means of doing your makeup. I hope that is pretty explanatory. Yeah, if you want to see how I got this simple look, then keep watching. Please make sure you give this video a thumbs up, make sure you like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys. Give me the light. Give me that push, give me that bad man thing, give me that push, give me that tin that blow my mind, give me that tin that So I've already done my skincare routine. So if this is a makeup where you are using it during the daytime, you need to put your sunscreen. And today's sunscreen, I'll be using the spray one. This is the La Rouge Posay. Posay sunscreen but i don't have the cream one i don't have lotion one it's finished so i'm just going to spray my face with this now that i look like a grease ball i'm just going to rub that in So now that my sunscreen is on, the next thing to apply is your face primer and I'll be using the professional face primer by Benefit Cosmetics. So I'm just going to put that on my face, make sure to block those pores. I'm going to use my setting powder. This is the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Powder. I'm just going to use that and like set my face. This takes away the shine from my face. And as you can see, that's already given it like a bit of coverage. I want a matte foundation, like I want something that my foundation can last long, my makeup can last long, but at the same time, I want something dewy. So to achieve that, I'm going to try mixing these two foundations. I already have a review on this foundation, it's going to pop up now. And ah, I like the foundation a bit, but I'm going to try mixing it with my matte foundation to see if it works so i'm just taking a bit of the nyx can't stop on stop foundation and taking a few squeeze of the fenty beauty foundation and just apply that on my skin and to do this makeup faster i use my brushes i'm going to use my concealer and just highlight my face I'm just going to leave my concealer to sit. So since there's not a lot of time to do your brows, I highly suggest you use your brow pencil because brow pencils are easier to apply. Use your spoolie and blend that in. Take a bit of concealer, clean your brows, and that is all. <laughs> So I'm going to leave my brows like this for a bit and I'm just going to blend out my highlighter just because I feel it has given me enough coverage that I want. I'm just going to blend that in. So I'll use my foundation brush and just go over my concealer just to remove any harsh line. This is how it looks like. There is no time for baking and all those stuff. So I'm just going to use my setting powder. This is the Huda Beauty setting powder. 
and I'm just going to set that using my face powder I'm just going to set my whole face take my contour kit I'm just going to take a lighter contour powder and just warm up my face and also apply my blush to remove all the powderiness, I'm going to use my setting So I'm not going to apply any um, eyeshadow or anything, but I'm going to take my dark contour kit and just put a bit of dimension on my crease. That way my crease doesn't look too plain, but I'm not really doing anything on it. I'm just putting in that color. I'm blending it out. I'm just going to pop on my highlighter, and this is the Gerald Cosmetics highlighter in Dirty. I'm just going to tap into it and highlight my face. This gives you like a subtle glow, and I also highlight my brow bone. So I'm not really a mascara person, I don't even have any mascara because I pretty much don't even have eyelashes. So for me personally, no matter how simple I go, no matter how simple I go, I always fix my lashes because yeah, lashes just brings everything together. I'm just going to use um, an eye paint, eyeliner just to line my waterline but I'm not going to do like wing liner, I'm just going to line my waterline and fix all my lashes. So I'm just twisting up. It's just a twist up eyeliner. I've lined my waterline and I'm just going to pop on my lashes. Okay. So just because I am dramatic, I'm going to add green eyeliner under my eyes. Then I'll also pop in some highlighter on my tear dot. So for my lips, I like just putting on lip gloss, but if I'm not going to put plain lip gloss like this, I'm just going to put a lip liner and put my lip gloss on it. That's basically what I just do. So, taking my lip pencil, just adding a bit of brown to the lips. <laughs> Then we pop in some lip gloss. This is the final look. If you just want to look put together when going out, I don't want to be bothered with my hair. This is just something I feel is easy and you don't need to do too much. You can actually rock this look without your lashes, but for me, I I feel lashes put everything together. If you see a clip here where I was without my lashes, you could see my face was beer and everything so yeah lashes brings out everything my makeup took me 15 minutes and even the 15 minutes is because i already have like everything set up but if you don't have everything like set up you have to like reach out and everything it's gonna take you more than 15 minutes let's let's be real to ourselves let's be real especially if you you don't just want to put just foundation. Let's let's say the truth. It's gonna take you more than 15 minutes to reach out for everything that you need. The only part where I mentioned already that might be a struggle might be doing your brows because even for me, my brows still take some time. So yes, guys, this is the end of this video. If you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. This video was recommended by my friend Stephanie. Make sure you check her video, her YouTube out. I'm going to link it in the description box below and yeah thank you for watching i'll see you in my next video bye guys